remember what the haters talking about. What's up, family? Kevin Spacey accuser Arthur Ori Ben, who was once married to a Norwegian princess, has allegedly committed suicide. He is the third Kevin Spacey accuser to die under mysterious circumstances. One guy got hit by a car. Another guy's family has yet to release the details of his death. Can you say Clinton's? A massage therapist died in September. A man in Massachusetts who's 18 years old dropped his lawsuit. What do y'all think? Y'all think these cases are connected? I mean, like, y'all think there may be some foul play here? I'm not a conspiracy theorist. But I do think that Kevin knows what's going on. These are not coincidences. I just don't believe that these are coincidences. I think Kevin Spacey is actually going to walk because out of the over a dozen men who have accused him of sexual assault, I don't think it's going to be anybody left standing. I think they're going to all get the hint and be like, man, let me back up off that. Kevin Spacey, for real, he always struck me as that type of dude who had like a dark history, you know. You know, sometimes when people play those roles, man, they play those roles a little bit too good. And he's very good with those dark roles, those dark, sinister roles. Now, the guy who is the uh, who allegedly killed himself, Ori Ben, they say that he claims that Kevin assaulted him in 2007 at a Nobel Peace Prize concert. The massage therapist says that Kevin assaulted him after a massage session. Listen. Say what you want about me, but I don't like no dude touching on me. Massages, that's an intimate thing to me. Now, yeah, that getting all naked and stuff and having a dude do all that. I ain't blaming the victim, man, but come on. I just be looking at that type of stuff like this is one of them situations where if it go down, it go down. If you, if I like what I see, I'm feeling it, it gonna go down. But if not, that's sexual assault. I'm not saying all massage therapists are like this. I'm just saying. You doing it and you a dude on a dude. You know. That's suspicious to me. You know, that's just my my antenna go up on something like that. To be honest, I don't even like women touching on me like that, massaging me. I don't like women, like strange women I don't know, massaging me, doing all that stuff. Um, I have to be really, really in pain to get a massage from somebody I don't know. I really have to be like in, in, in desperate need of some soothing to do that. I don't like them doing all that stuff, touching all. I don't like that feel, you know. Yeah. But anyway, what do y'all think here? Do y'all think Kevin has something to do with this? Or do y'all think these people who are dropping dead just happens to be a coincidence? I'm going back to the guy in Massachusetts, the 18-year-old who dropped his lawsuit. And I'm just thinking, did he drop that lawsuit because he didn't want to drop dead? No more talk.
What the haters talking about?